Hey guys, today we're going to be drawing a mandala in Procreate. I'm using the iPad Pro with the Procreate app. If you're new to Procreate, I also have a video called 25 Procreate Tips and Tricks, which is good to watch first because as I draw, I'll be using these actions. I will link that video below. So here I am in the Procreate gallery. We're going to hit the plus sign here and we're just going to select a square canvas and I just have a 12 inch by 12 inch square. So let's go into our settings. We're going to enable the drawing guide. Then we're going to hit edit drawing guide. We want to make sure that symmetry is selected. Then we're going to go into options, select radial. And what this is going to do is going to give you eight pie shapes. And then we're going to hit assisted drawing. And from here, you can also change the opacity of the guides as well as the thickness and the color up here. So once you're happy, hit done. So essentially what we're doing is whatever we do on one pie shape is gonna mimic on the rest. So I've got my black selected and I'm gonna select a calligraphy brush. So I'm just gonna work on this pie shape up here. And there's no rhyme or reason in this. I'm literally just doing whatever my brain tells me. And if I zoom out, you can see what's happening so far. I'm just going to alternate my brush. I'm just going to select just a round brush. All right guys, I think that's it. Now we can obviously go all the way to the edge of the canvas, but I'm gonna stop it right here. And from this point, you can do lots of things with it. You can create a new layer, and then we're gonna drag it underneath the first layer. We're gonna click on the layer and hit draw assist. And what that does again is it enables the symmetry. So we can color this, but it's best to pick a color palette that 
has light colors. So I already have one here called Blueberry. So we can begin by coloring. I'm just gonna switch my brush to my brown brush. Now obviously we can work on that same layer and just color drop it, but what I find is it's not that accurate. And I will show you in just a second. Now if you wanna make it go faster by coloring, just go back to that initial layer and then we can just color drop. However, sometimes you might have holes, like if you forgot to close, you know, a shape. But for example, if I go to this one right here, you can see there's a little white that's missing. And then once you try to fix it, you're gonna go over the black. And sometimes if you don't close your shapes, you end up just color dropping the entire canvas. I like to create a new layer underneath and just manually color them. It's also therapeutic. Also, what you can do is you can print this out. So what we wanna do is just disable the background, make sure it's a transparent image, then click on settings, and then you wanna select PNG, once it exports, you can save the image, you can text it, you can email it to yourself, and then you can print it out. So again, you wanna make sure that your initial canvas is large, maybe an eight by eight, so that you can print it out on a piece of paper. So if you do a lot of these, you can create a coloring book, you can sell them as well. Um, so there's many things you can do with this. So I'm just gonna go and finish coloring. All right, I'm gonna stop right there and I'm gonna go back into my settings and just go into canvas and disable the drawing guide and look how pretty that is. Now we can still like color the background and all that, but I'm gonna leave it white like that. I think it looks really nice. So there you have it guys. There is your mandala drawn in Procreate using the symmetry assist. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. To get notified of more new videos where I teach you to draw, 
Be sure to subscribe to Draw with Marina.